Abilene, Kansas, 1910. Going into the bull's head. Don't I know you, sir? Don't believe so. I haven't been here in many years. Name's Silas Greaves. Silas Greaves? The bounty hunter? Hey, Loki. Used to be. Ah, well, what are you doing here in Abilene? Just passing through. Got a little business to take care of. Well, sir, it would be an honor if you would allow me to buy you a beer. Hell, son, it would be my honor to drink it. I'm Molly. Howdy. I'm Dwight. That's Jack and Steve. Ben's behind the bar. Oh, I bet you got some great stories. A couple. <laughs> Any of them true. Jack, be nice. A few. What about your shootout with Henry Plummer's gang in Bannock, Montana? I yeah, is sure, that where Loki. he started as a bounty hunter? That's what, what it, it says in this here dime novel. Curious what Don't it is. Don't believe everything you read in them dime novels, boy. First man I hunted was back when I was riding with Billy the Kid. Oh, you Billy knew Billy kid. the Kid? Damn right. That scrawny son of a bitch had no fear. Wouldn't back down for nobody. I heard he collected the tin stars off any crooked lawman who crossed him. It was a war, boy. The Lincoln County War. And Billy promised his regulators would take the life of every bastard who helped bushwhack John Tunstall. Kid had a big chip on his shoulder and a hair trigger temper. Made him dangerous as hell. Once upon a time in stinking springs. Silas Greaves arrived in Abilene in 1910, claiming he had written something, 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 because I couldn't read it all. Here we go. Start the game. It was about 30 years ago. Billy was hiding out in an abandoned farm near Stinking Springs. How's it I going, threw Bumitas? in with the kid because the man I had sworn vengeance on was riding with Billy's enemies. But before I tell you why I want that some bitch dead, let me tell you what happened that day. I was heading back to the hideout when suddenly I had this funny feeling. Funny, ha ha? No, Steve. The other kind of funny. Nice man. You heard Pat. We need to stay here and keep an eye on the road. That's not fair. Okay. You're missing all the fun. I knew those two morons would never let me makes through. Sense. I had no choice. I did, but with us, yeah. Who's that? Is he with us? Hey, okay, XP. Makes sense. Was it Pat Garrett's posse? Oh, yeah. I heard the shots oh, and I knew I had to move fast. They're coming from the rear. Garrett and his army of deputies the kid. surrounded the entire homestead. I decided to help Billy and the boys out of it. So that's just what I did. Behind him. Stay on it. Cover fire. As the governor of New Mexico was paying for the kids' apprehension, Garrett was able to hire every gun hand in Lincoln County. Ah, oh, damn. I knew that going through that front door meant putting my butt in a shooting gallery, so I decided to get sneaky. Oh yeah, let's go. Secret found! The Lincoln County War. Oh, I just leveled up. Okay.
Akimbo. All right. Fuck it. Achievement unlocked. Keep 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 at it. I was like, keep it all. What? Keep at it. Watch out! He's one of them. God damn it! He's right behind us. Where the hell? Garrett's he? men were Never running ran around ran. like a bunch of chickens with their heads cut off. These some bitches. <laughs> One of them reached the water tower. Not a bad idea. It would be a turkey shoot from up there. Luckily, these shooters here and hired weren't the sharpest tools in the shed. God damn. A lot of or saddle tramps, or sod busters, or drunken drifters looking to make a few bucks. I damn. Then, I heard a friendly voice yelling at me from the window. Back door! We got we'll cover you! Try aiming, you idiot! Truth be told, things weren't much play. better behind the house. Put some howls in it. Come on, come on, come on. Cut their numbers in half. But that just made the ones that were left twice as mad. They made up for their lack of skill with a seemingly endless supply of ammo. It was a bit of a slog, <laughs> but I finally fought my way around the back of the house. Seemingly endless supply. How they keep getting ammo? I'm just making sure there's no loot back here that I'm missing out on. We're good. And like that, you I was inside. Dead, you None the worse for wear. I passed Dirty Dave. Get her than a rat in a and upstairs, I found Billy and Charlie Baldry. Billy the Kid, 21 killed by age 21. Smart as a whip. Billy looked at me and said, About time, amigo. Grab a gun and get to the window. Wait, Grab a gun. So you were friends with Billy the Kid. He just gave me his gun. I could have got the yeah, one sort next of. to the ammo. Anyway, we were surrounded by dozens of deputized shooters who wanted to do us harm. I'm telling you, Garrett's men were dropping like flies, but they just kept on coming. Where the hell Garrett got to? He's missing all the action. Yeah, buddy. That's when Charlie got hit. They're catching us oh, in a crossfire, what? shouted Billy. Get to the other side. Ah, oh, damn, I'm getting lit up. Suckers I personally put down, but it was pretty clear, even to Billy, that maybe discretion was the better part of valor. Jesus. What's that mean? It means that it was time to cut and run. Oh, no. They got a gallon, oh, no. Billy shouted. Get the horses and bring them around back. I'll draw their attention. Oh, shit. He directed that order at me, and I thought, why the hell do I have to do it? But I went anyway. Dumbass that I was back then. Uh, Many would have fled in my place. But I had that false sense of invincibility that many young men have. Like Jack. What are you saying, old man? Jack, he's just joshing with you now. 
Yeah, he's he just joshing with you. Mr. Graves, please continue. Please call me Silas. Oh, melee. Now, uh, where was I? God damn. You were heading for the barn. Right. Making my way past the castle of the oh, 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 Kimbo. Come on now. Let's go. I got some points, but we don't spend them. It's deep pockets. Longer combos. Let's do that. Sounds like Garrett hired a whole regiment of hired guns. Yeah. And just when I thought I was done with it, more of these hapless bastards would pop up. Hello. Finally, I had the stables within my reach. And that's when I met Sheriff Pat Garrett. I read that you went toe-to-toe -to -toe with him, sir. That backstabbing bastard with that tacked-on tin star. Proud, handsome, and ham-handed. Okay. We gonna have a duel on our hands here? You challenged him to a showdown. You read that Shoot. in a dime novel? It said he showed no fear as he took your measure with eyes like a rattlesnake. In a fair fight. Bam! <laughs> Is that what that Penny Dreadful said? No, boy. That ain't what I meant when I said I met Pat Garrett. So let me start again. I finally reach those damn stables. This time for real is what it says. She stepped inside and Bam! Bam! Last thing I heard was Garrett's voice. That's not Billy. And go on. How did it end? End? Boy, that was just the beginning. <laughs> that was the start of it, friend. I got an honorable kill. Weapon of choice, six shooter, award of choice, headshot. Let's go, dude. 